Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's Black Ops Cold War video, guys. Today, I'm going to let you know that my controller did not come in yet. Uh, I I might have had issues with my uh, Android situation, so I'm still using the same old broken controller, and we're just, we're just going to have to deal with it, but, you know, that that's life. Let's hop into a game. All right, so we were able to find the beginning of a game, which is very cool. I like that a lot. Like I said, we're rocking the RPD, because if you don't know, my left and also is broken you're gonna see like where i randomly just can't why am i still hearing the sound as if we were just now coming in like what happened but you'll see that my guy just like randomly stops running it's so weird i don't understand but we're just rocking the rpd for that reason and um yeah just vibing out i i am finally like done completely done taking any painkillers for my mouth pain uh, i've been done with all my prescribed stuff uh, but I was taking I like a little bit of ibuprofen still just to because I still had like some pain I have like a tiny bit left, but it's down enough to where I am totally done by taking any painkillers just because I don't want to take Oh, I just got stuck up a rental for my teammates. Sorry about that blackbird I just don't want to take too many like pain because I can't believe that just happened I don't want to take too many painkillers though and just you know I feel like, you know, too much of anything is bad. So I, I'm just, uh, you know, with the little bit of pain I have left, I'm just toughing it out. This guy's going to peek me. I know he is. All right, that. Wait. Oh, I suck. Oh, I suck right there. I should have killed that guy. I don't know. But this week, we're getting prepared for our CDL Draft League still. Uh, I'm playing against, who am I playing against? Notorious this week. I feel like I'm going to do just good. I think I'm going to do just fine. The last week, I destroyed everyone. I mean, I scored the top ranked. Actually, the only person who was close to me was Scary. Scary Gary was close. But I have like him and I were in the 400s. Everyone else was in the 300s, and I obviously know week to week each player can play differently. But I'm playing against Notorious this week, and last I checked, he, he hopefully he changed it by now. Especially, I'm sure like Tig let him know. But last week he had a BZ on his bench, so I should be good in our fantasy league this week. I would imagine we do have some more progress towards our uh, eights, like our own like eights league that I mentioned in yesterday's video. So this Friday, like I said, is going to be our first day of it, and I actually have an idea of every month actually resetting like the league ladder i think that would be like a really cool idea that wait you're just sitting in there he was just <laughs> he's just sitting in there waiting for me dude he's using the dual magnums which man i mean i don't blame him. i'm literally i'm using them too you literally have like you see how my guy won't run you literally have to run them i mean if they're not gonna like fix them ever it's dumb to not run them honestly oh i'm gonna try to slide forward and that's not even close to a good idea apparently Oh, no, I'm sorry about that. They literally, the game made me do it. The game made me do it. So our new plan with the eights league, if you guys don't know, what we're going to do is we're trying to do a league where we play eights and like just rain. It can be like any random time. Like the owners are this next for our, this coming Friday is like a scheduled date. It's just simply because like that's, you know, I, this Friday I'm going to be playing. So I just really wanted to do it. And Friday nights are the easiest to get everyone on because no one has school the next day, you know, and most people like don't have work the next day. Uh, but so what what we really want to do is make it so every week the ladder resets that way dude i don't know like i don't I mean i like i like playing league play a lot more than playing 6v6 but with the the I, you see how i can't run i'm trying so hard to run but my guy just won't like he just this is me like literally trying to sprint that whole time um but like we don't want anyone to get too far behind like you know what i'm saying like let's say oh my goodness i can't shoot anyone but let's say there's someone who just like can't play for a week we you know i don't want you to get like so far behind that you feel like you like you're just totally out of the league which i don't think anyone like would feel that way or anything like that but also like let's say someone just like wants to grind really hard they get super far ahead of the league and then they need to take a break and they feel like they like they lost all their spots so it's like you know what like this week or this month you you like top you were top of the leaderboard and now next month if you want to take a break you can you know like you can just hold down like that you know you, you can say forever now that you had that number one spot for that month you know like for the month of march so this is this march is gonna be you know like right now we're in march is gonna be the first time i can't run forward no matter how hard i try no i am marking him no i wanted to kill him so bad the new controller is coming tomorrow i called fedex i confirmed they have my new address what happened was i accidentally i accidentally forgot to put my apartment number on my address because i ordered through best buy and they had my address saved and they said is this the correct address i just clicked yes I didn't double check it because you know the first numbers were all the same i didn't think in a million years i would ever have a situation where i don't have is that proximity mine not gonna blow up on him but i didn't think in a million years i would ever have a situation where the proximity of my art the proximity of mine 
my like apartment number like wasn't saved with the rest of my address so i didn't even check it so i checked the like tracking and it literally said that the controller was here today it was at my apartment building but the driver didn't know which uh, apartment to bring it into so oh i just seen that guy jump up he didn't know which apartment to bring it into so he didn't bring it in at all so I can't wait for that to uh, come and that'll be a good time. And also what I think I really want to do, I'm not 100% sure on this yet, but I think I want to try a new sensitivity. I think I want to try 88.5 sensitivity because so right now I play on 66.8. So if you don't know what that means, so I play on 66 sensitivity like when I'm looking around like this. So when you're aimed down sight, it's 0.8 of six, which is four. So my regular sensitivity is a six. And then my aim down sight to four, which is what I like. I like when my aim down sight to four. Even though I'm an SMG player, I know that's like that's not like a good idea. But I've always just found that when I have a four sensitivity, like all of Modern Warfare, I played four four the whole time. So what I'm thinking about doing is change my sensitivity to eight eight sensitivity for so I can like turn faster like this, like or spin faster if I need to, like turn around on someone faster if I need to. But then you know I'll have 0.5 sensitivity. So I, would they have an attack helicopter? That's not good. But then I can have a 0.5, like, aim down sight sensitivity for, you know, when I'm aimed down sight, I can just... I don't gotta worry about it. Is this helicopter, like... Is this a thing right now? I don't have, like, the plus vehicle damage to destroy this thing. And, of course, I can't even... See, none of the maps in this game, except for satellite, are good for kill streaks. Literally, none of them are. You on top of the calic. I'm sorry I had to do that to you, sir, but that's just how I had to be done. I'm going in here. Dual magnum. Ready? Three, two, one. Gone. Three. Oh, there was another... I was just hoping that that smoke... We just made that guy like not even want to look at me. I'm just gonna stay back here and get ready for the next hill, boys. Let's make sure we win this game, yeah? Another wisdom tooth like surgery update is I've been able to eat I mean just about anything. I feel like I haven't really had a food that I like ate and like it I regretted it. I guess the only thing that I still like haven't tried yet that I really like want to is I really like eating like spice and chicken patties for like lunch. So from like either Chick-fil-A or from like you know, like, buying a pack of spicy chicken patties from Walmart. I, do, I don't know where that guy was, but I couldn't run away. Like, I wanted to slide cancel around, like, my, let my teammate on the head glitch kill him. But whatever, dude. I'll get a new controller soon. Oh. But other than that, I mean, I've had pizza, which is, like, one of the scarier things to have. Now, when I did eat the pizza, I had, like, it was one of those pizzas that's cut into squares, not triangles or whatever. So, I didn't have any crust pieces, and I ate it with, in small bites real slow like so that was good i have not and i will not be eating chips for a while that is one thing i am very scared of trying i really do not want to eat chips and just have them like tear anything or get lodged in anywhere or anything like that i will not and have not tried any chips yet oh no dude oh wait what so i killed the guy on the catwalk with ease but that guy who's right in front of me i can't interesting interesting video game i'm just gonna sit here and hold down the line I'm just gonna hold down this line right here. I don't care who's getting killed anywhere around me. You guys can't hear me talking and that's okay because you don't really need to hear me talking when you're just watching me have a great time. Where is anyone? I'm just shooting around. Oh, hi, there you are. I was about to say, I'm just shooting. Oh my goodness, we have the death machine. Let's get really loud in your guys' ears, dude. Head Headphone users warning, beware. Oh, I just seen you. Oh, nice. That's death machine, bruv. Oh, that guy got me, you son of a gun. So what's really weird about this broken controller is auto sprint is actually like makes makes it worse so the actual clicking down isn't like a problem like the clicking down to sprint isn't a problem what happens is like my controller like randomly will like just tick like a dead zone like when i'm holding up and so my guy will stop for a second like literally like a millisecond but when he stops for a millisecond he stops running and then i have to like press running again where for some reason when i have it on like auto sprint like it won't do it. like so in order for me to i should i wonder if i should have made that face the other way but in order for me to make like the sprint happen to get an auto sprint i have to either crouch or jump to reset my auto sprint which is like so weird but when i'm on regular like regular like just push down to sprint you know like whenever my guy stops sprinting i just push it down again and we're good to go i think my teammates just gave these guys a full 60 seconds on the uh oh all right whatever silly me with the nade i think my teammates just gave these guys a full 60 seconds on this so which kind of oh no there's a guy lights which really stings but what are you gonna do i'm gonna grab this ak-47 i'm gonna grab this broken ak-47 and not hit this guy with one single bullet because i was so confident that he would just die by me just looking at him that i stopped aiming because i said oh wait that's a bad guy dude i'm blind but now you guys know my plan you know no more uh no more painkillers or anything from my mouth i mean like i said it still hurts like a little bit but 
I feel like I'm just gonna, you know, I can ice it still. You know, I'm not scared to ice it. I'll just ice it, you know, and just just try to take care of my mouth. I don't want to take any more painkillers. I'm gonna get my new controller uh, tomorrow. So, well, uh, hopefully, I said this yesterday, but hopefully by the time this video comes out, I already have the new controller. Oh, there will not be uh, today. For you guys today, for me tomorrow, there will not be a stream. Uh, my wife works this weekend, so she's gonna be gone all weekend long. So I'm just gonna spend the day with her tomorrow, which once again is for you guys. Like, so tonight, if you're watching this on the day it comes out, tonight there will not be a stream. I'm just gonna spend the time with Mrs. Rudy. Then this weekend, we are gonna get absolutely cracked. We're gonna go buy some G Fuel cans from the gas station. We're gonna get absolutely shrambolied. We're gonna get cracked out of our mind. We're gonna, pro more than likely, I'm gonna take the time to learn the new sensitivity that I really wanna learn, the 88.5, which I don't even necessarily feel like I absolutely have to do that, but I want to, like, what's the, what's the deal? I want to just, like, be able to turn on people quicker if that was, like, necessary. And like I said, you know, if I'm, you know, I'm an SMG player, the faster I can turn the better and then you know with the thankfully with Call of Duty like how they have so much more freedom in your sensitivity now when I aim down sight I can still have the same sensitivity I was already having so I feel like it's a good idea I know I seen on Twitter RCDs I've been saying this in stream a lot lately because ever since I found out I thought it was crazy RCDs the phase main AR plays 1010.25 sensitivity so when he's like just looking around like hip firing he's on 1010 sensitivity and then when he's aimed on sight, he's on a four sensitivity. And that's a really good idea for him because he's a main AR. So he's like, you know, never hit firing anyway. So that's like a good idea. I don't want to get that crazy because I do hit fire a little bit as a sub player. You know what I'm saying? Like I, every once in a while, like I'll mantle like hit fire someone. So that's, oh man, we lost this game by two seconds. And I dropped 44 kills. I mean, what are you going to do though? It is what it is. Just a pub. This tiny man here got a new bed. So it's a little small, but... You know, the other size they had was way too big. And he, when he curls up, he fits in. And I think he likes it. You know, he didn't give it really, you know, I think he likes it. But that is going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you guys once again for all the support on all the videos and especially the YouTube shorts. They've been a lot of fun. If you're one of the people, though, who are, you know, you like TikTok more than YouTube shorts. I post this. I didn't mean to slap my mic. I post the same video on YouTube shorts as I do on TikTok. And the reason why I do that, so that might sound lazy, you know, not having original content on both platforms. The reason I do that is I just have this feeling that there are some people who prefer to watch that style of video on YouTube and then there are other people who prefer to watch it on TikTok and I didn't want someone who just like is on TikTok doesn't want to watch YouTube shorts to miss it I didn't want to want someone who's on YouTube shorts and not on TikTok to miss the content you know I so I just figured I, I don't really see a word like I don't I can't think of a reason why anyone would be on both YouTube shorts and TikTok because I feel like everyone probably does like the idea that I have which is just upload the same thing to both. So I don't know. So that's just what I do. So feel free to check it out in either one of those. But thank you guys for watching today's video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe on your way out. And I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.